As far back as I can remember, food has always been an obsession for me. When I was a kid, I used to be overweight. Not because I had heavy bones, or because I have inherited easy gain weight genes from my parents. Nah, I loved fast food. And the more, the better. You see that cafeteria over there? That's a food corner where I used to eat every week, for several days, for several years. This is me when I was about 9 years old. I almost went more to the cafeteria than I went to school. I loved fast food. I loved it so much that I didn't want to eat anything else. I kind of became addicted to it. Croquettes, fricandelle, french fries, hamburgers, it didn't matter. As long as I could combine it with a lot of mayonnaise, I was happy. The worst part of it all was that my mother didn't know about it. Or at least, well she kind of knew, but didn't know the danger. Or simply didn't care. Look at me eating. I was in heaven. Or at least I thought I was. And when I was not eating, I was in hell, so it felt. Nowadays, at least I can enjoy other food. Oh, and shopping. It was a complete disaster. Even when I went to the supermarket with my mother, we bought the wrong stuff. Just a simple, fast, easy and cheap meals, snacks and drinks. I mean... You understand, right? What in the world is easier than throwing a pizza in the oven or a packaged meal you can warm up in a microwave? Just the idea of pre-packed food now makes me want to puke. Luckily, now I love vegetables and I can enjoy a proper meal at least. I think the major turning point was when I was around the age of 15. You see, because I gained so much weight, physical movements became very difficult. Look how sad, poor little me. I couldn't even walk a staircase. Walking a short staircase became a major task for me. The more weight I gained, the worse the bullying got at school. Not in the last place, because with every movement, especially with gymnastics, everybody could see all my body parts move. It was terrible. This is maybe the worst of everything. My mother was alone and she had stuff to do even after she finished work. She didn't have time to prepare me a proper meal so instead she chose for the easy way. And even if she tried to prepare me a healthy meal, I complained that I didn't like it. I started asking for the things I usually ate, like these disgusting cheeseburgers warmed up in the microwave. They taste like crap, seriously. You see, cooking takes time, especially if you don't do it that often. But if you cook something yourself, not only is it much more tastier, you don't feed yourself with the chemical trash because that's how food companies make their food to keep the cost low. Imagine just the amount of salt, sugar, e-numbers or other food additives from which we don't even know what they will do with our bodies in the long term. But just as anybody else, once in a while I'll still go to my first love, the cafeteria, and order a portion of fries with a delicious snack, or just a donor, or doesn't matter. That's how much more people should do it, eat healthy and snack once in a while. Thankfully I got the message, but what about you?